Hey guys, this is Dave with Saluda Grade Farm and today I wanted to share with you how I germinate my seeds. There's the $30 germination chamber, but while I got you back here, I'll give you the $2 tour. So this is where I wash my salad greens, all of this. And this, I flip it over, fill it with water, and I plumb a jacuzzi pump to it. And it bubbles and cleans the, uh, cleans the salad greens. This is where I dry them. And I, this is a converted washer machine. And it uh, spins, spins the salad greens dry. And then that's where I bag everything. All right, so back to this. So that's, that's the uh, germination chamber. And my local transfer station has a place where you can drop off and pick up old appliances. And so I picked up this, this old refrigerator. I think it was just somebody's beer fridge and they liked racing. But anyway, I have a seedling mat thermostat hooked up to it. That's the bulk of the cost for this. That was like 20 bucks off of Amazon. And I, the, it has a wire that runs through here. And I just hang up back there towards the top. And that is connected to this $10 mini miniature crock pot that I set on high. And that's pretty much it. I've got, here I've got hydroponic carrots growing. And I've got hydroponic lettuce in there growing in this oasis. So this thing here has been has been just a huge uh, game changer for me because now I don't have to germinate them. You know, most people put say put their put your seeds on top of the fridge and germinate them there, and you know you, you may get a little bit better, but this this thing can just pump them out, and it it, it germinates them like clockwork because I can set the exact temperature, and even on cold nights when it's 25, 30 degrees. This thing will still be, you know, can can keep up in the 60, 70 degree range, and so it's it's perfect. I've even um, had it unplugged or disconnected one time, and it went down into the 20s that night. And then the next day, all the seeds were fine. They, those seedlings ended up coming out just fine. So uh, I love this thing. It doesn't take up any room in my house. It's completely waterproof. And as you saw, I had the bag on the thermostat down here. That's to keep it. That's to keep it wet, um, because I I know from experience they're not waterproof. In fact, the one on my seedling table that I use for for uh, cold nights when I'm when I have seedlings up in my greenhouse, it shocks you if you touch the table. So, so, anyway, they're not waterproof. So, but but this as a whole, it it is. And I've had no problems with this. And it, even like pepper seeds, it can it can uh, germinate them in just a few days. Every type of plant likes a different temperature to germinate. So I, I realized that kale, peppers, uh, tomatoes, they like it around 86 degrees. Spinach and lettuce, they like it around 72 degrees. And things like broccoli and cabbage they like 77 degrees so maybe one day i'll do a video on what uh what temperatures and germination um or like a post a chart or something like that but anyway um like i said this thing has been a game changer and i appreciate you guys i got over 200 subs um this past uh this past weekend and so i really appreciate you guys uh thanks for liking sharing and commenting on my, all my videos and uh, thanks uh, thanks for watching